Hello! Uh, we wanted to give you a whole video saying some of the things that we hope for you <laughs> while you are we in Christian We hope you don't settings. get hit with a stick. <laughs> oh, was, I could actually touch her head very lightly. I was hoping I would laugh her a little more. I'm Rafiki today. I'm a wise old gent. So, here's things. the first piece of wisdom. We hope for you <laughs> to use your class time wisely. Yes. Meaning, we do actually expect that when you're in Christian studies that you are working! You have a lot of freedom. Uh, as you know, it's a self-paced course now. Um, you have a lot of freedom in how you use your time. But we do expect that you are using your class time to work on something or another. Which means, even though you have these lovely computers that the school supplies and everything, you know, the internet has many things on it. We're not okay with you using your time to play video games. Absolutely not. Even if you're done with all of your homework. It's a no-go. Sorry, guys. Um, so with no video games, um, we do expect that you're working, but it doesn't have to be Christian studies. So if you need to work on something from another class because you have a big test coming up or you just need a break, that's fine too. You can work on something else. We just expect that you're using it productively. It's up to our discretion, so if you're like hardcore horsing around, we might have a conversation. Okay, how about late work policy? So I think a big question in any class is, how do we deal with late work? And the truth is, is- <laughs> We love your late work. Well, we, we don't, don't like that it comes in late. Love your late work, but we will take your work late. Except for, Ooh. ding, 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 everybody <laughs> listen. This is a test question. Warning, warning, warning. <laughs> Discussion boards. Yes. Everything except for discussion boards can be coming in late. Or, yeah, can be returned in late. Everything except for discussion boards can be turned in late Which for full credit. also includes discussion videos. Ooh, yeah. So make sure that you have those turned in on time because if you miss this, the discussion, you miss the work. And we will not take that late. No. Why? Because the whole point of a discussion board is that you're having conversation back and forth. And if you're not doing it within the time frame that's allotted, well, that's a problem because nobody's going to be conversing with you. That means that the discussion board has failed and so have you. Oh. <laughs> well, it's not totally, just the discussion. Anyway, the we next... We want to talk to you about your spaces. Where are you allowed to work, yo? Um, um well... There's really three spaces you're allowed to work. Um, this one gets confused. It's the Shields Atrium. I'll tell you about that. Atrium. The Atrium, Shields Atrium. Um, you can work in Hechner Chapel, and you can work in the Christian Studies classroom. So, let me explain this a little bit more. Like, so we're standing right now in the hallway between Hechner Chapel and the Shields Atrium. Um, the Shields Atrium is literally just the lobby way. It's not the theater hallway. It's not the hallway with the beautiful art. The storage arch. hallway. The storage hallway. Not the storage hallway. It's not really that Wait beautiful. a minute. Can I use the hallway that like goes down to the storage? You can because that is within like, it's visible. <laughs> it's visible. <laughs> That's basically what we need. We need to be able to see you without searching for you. That's really what's going on. So, um, the Shields Atrium, there's all that space with tables, you can use that. You can't use either of the two hallways that come off of the Shields Atrium. You cannot go into Shields, like the actual performing art center. You can't go in there. You can't use the music rooms. They're all off limits. Um, you, you can, however, use this hallway, this hallway that is a walkway between Heckner and Shields. And um, using the space up, up in the classroom, the Christian Studies classroom, that is only available to you uh, when there's not a seminar going on and if you have an A or a B. So that's all class. of you right now because all of you have an A. Which means everyone. Yay. So keep that up and you can keep using that space. Cool. And Heckner Chapel. Oh. We should talk a little bit about that one because Heckner Chapel is, by the way, a chapel. It's a chapel. And so the expectation is that you act accordingly, which means... It's a quiet space. Like, use, yeah. use that for, for quieter activities. You're not going to be going in there to have really loud discussions no. or... Um, to be, like, jamming out to some, like, Christian screamo music. Yeah. Not a good space for that. No. Well, so let me say this. Um, you're going to have a, a decent number of assignments, more than likely, uh, that are going to require you to film some videos. And um, if you look at the pro tips video, we'll tell you more about how to get a really good video. Um, however, there are 
many of the spaces that you can use are not always the best places to so film a video. What happens if I need to go someplace else then? That's the question. We have some ways for you to sign out during class so you could go and use a, a quieter space. Um, like for instance, if you wanted to use um, the small rehearsal room, there's a whiteboard right by our office. Oh look, here it comes. Um, right by our office that all you have to do is sign out. It says, who? Me. <laughs> Put your name. Um, where? There. Where you're going. When? <laughs> then. Put the time it is right now. Um, so we will be able to know at a glance where you're located and we can come and find you should you need to be. You can sign out for a maximum of 10 minutes at a time. How long? 10 minutes. Does it, that work? <laughs> oh. Okay, so uh, put your name down. You can be gone for 10 minutes. That means uh, if you need to plan your video ahead of time, plan it ahead of time. Because uh, you're going to be gone for 10 minutes at a time. Speaking of signing out, another really important part of this Ooh, class yeah. is signing out of class. We need to know that you stayed here during Christian studies and that yeah. you didn't go get silver, silver lining. <laughs> That's sad that we both were going to say silver lining. It's the best place downtown. It's delicious. We should take a class field trip. Maybe in the spring. Okay. Anyway, um, if you leave those spaces, make sure you sign out on the board. But here's the deal. You have to stay here during the whole class period. But if you end up leaving, I'm not talking about that right now. Okay. Um, rewind. Okay. You can leave three minutes early from class. Isn't that cool? We let you go three minutes early. So if you have to use the bathroom, that's a great. Just you have to sign out. So how do you sign out? Mr. Norell or myself will have a sign out sheet. That shows us that you were in class at the beginning when we took attendance and at the end Ooh. when class is over and you will be able to sign out three minutes, not four, not five, but three, three minutes early and we will let you go. At that time, you can also pick up your phone. Um, one other place you may need to sign out or generally you don't need to, is if you have to use the bathroom. I oh. just love it when you come and tell me you have to go to the bathroom, but that's not necessary. Yeah. I do love poop, but I don't need to know every time you need to poop. So if you need to use the bathroom, you can just use the bathroom, at least if you're using the one in the Shields atrium or this great pooper right here. Um, if you are upstairs in the classroom, there's also a whiteboard up there that you can sign out and say, hey, I'm up here, but I'm just using the bathroom real quick. If you, uh, for whatever reason, are using not one of those bathrooms, please just sign up so we know where you're at. Yes, and here's the other thing. Um, because we don't want there to be any problems, we are responsible for you while you're in Christian Studies class. And so if you do not sign out on one of the whiteboards and we can't find you, or if you don't come and sign out at the end of class, at the last three minutes, you will get detention for that. Also, here's a fun chant for you. There's only, only one, one spot, spot on the pot, pot so don't poop, poop in the group. group. Yeah, um, we have too much fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, please just go to the bathroom by yourself. No, nope, no potty parties. Girls, I know we like to do that. It's kind of fun, but like... Especially like single-use bathrooms, only one person. Oh yeah, that's a whole school rule, by the way. That's, that's just the way it is. So. Cool. Should Oops. we tell them about our phone policy? We want to tell you about our phone policy. <laughs> Um, so, you have all the technology that you need for this course, um, I would say 95% of the time, on the computer that the school provides you with. Fair enough. Um, so, you will not need your phone in Christian Studies. How oh, great. Uh, which means, when you walk into Christian Studies, we're going to have you turn in your phone, um, set it in the little check-in view hickey. Hang on. I've got my phone. Yeah. Put it your is. phone, sign it, or check it in at the start of class. It will remain there for the full class period. Uh, you'll take it back out when you sign out at the end of class. Um, there are a, a couple of uh, exceptions to that. We may assign a, a task where you need to use your phone, in which case you can ask for permission from us to use your phone, um, and we will likely, likely grant it, assuming that you actually need your phone to do it. Um, things you can't use your phone for, music, I know. Because you have YouTube on your computer. I know your AirPods don't connect to the school computer, but you can get $5 headphones if you really need to, or you can get headphones from Miss Murphy in the library. Yeah, totally. Uh, if you really need music, uh, you can get some from the library. Um, so yes, even music, 
What about you Instagram? No. You can I? I you just got an Insta message. No. Also, I know that many of your other classes use uh, fun apps. Quizlet. Uh, I think there's some Spanish app. I forget what I it is. I have it on my phone, but I forgot what it's called. Yeah, I was learning Norwegian with it. But guess but, what? What? You can use them on your computer. You actually can use them on you your can. computer. You can. It's really kind of cool. So uh, even if um, there's something that you specifically are using in another class on your phone, the answer is no. Um, only because it's way too easy for you to actually not do anything if you're using phone. So um, the answer for that is no. Your phone will stay checked in for the full class period. We're holding it hostage, basically. Yep. We're so just a it reminder. Hostage. Check it in at the beginning of class. Check it out. Get it at the end of class. Folks, if you have any questions about any of these things, that was a lot. Um, but if you have questions, you're always welcome to ask us.